I, it was actually funny. I was on a plane for softball. Um, we were just traveling. We were traveling home from just one of our preseason tournaments, and I got actually a Facebook message from the girl I ended up going over. She had sent out this message with some dates, people she knew that were interested in healthcare might be interested in the opportunity. And it was in that moment I was like, oh my gosh, the only three weeks of the whole summer I could do this, like exactly like what I want to do. Like I, have, I haven't been abroad, but I know that I wanted to, and it was just, I knew, I mean, I knew I had to talk to my parents and obviously find out more about it, but it was on that moment, honestly, on the plane when we um, were on our way back from a trip that I knew that it was something I wanted to do. I was just like, what are the odds? Like, I, you know, this was going to be a summer for me where I just, I had to take summer school. I had to, um, because I wanted, you know, I want to graduate on time and I had to um, just do certain um, volunteer hours, patient care hours to go towards grad school. And um, so it was just kind of like, okay, like, I guess this is just going to be a summer, you know, where I'm just working and, and pursuing towards that. And then the fact that this came up, the only three weeks of the summer I can do, and it's that patient care and that medical experience that is so valuable to what I want to do, like all in one. And I was just like, this is so fate. Like this is just, it's just meant to be. And um, it truly really was that. Um, really, it was just um, a connection I had through a friend. She had met a woman from actually Kansas who had, um, pursued um, doing missions over in South Africa and had actually started a life care center there and was looking for um, some people to go and help out and I just have always wanted to go to Africa. It was a dream. I never thought it would be a reality. Um, and of course I'm, you know, I'm interested in healthcare. I, I'm an aspiring physician assistant um, someday and I, um, so it was, pretty informal going over there, but um, it was just, I couldn't have asked for a better experience. Um, I was there for just three weeks, which was just perfect between summer school and workouts, and then between starting up again, it was just perfect how it worked out. My heart beats for people, like, and I love the science, like, sciences, and so I wanted to do healthcare ever since I was, like, 15 or something. I knew I wanted to do something that was involved with that, and, um, just it's so exciting going through college and and working towards that um, and so ultimately I, I don't know like what I would want to specialize in or or what I specifically would want to do but honestly this trip was just so much confirmation for me that that is what I'm supposed to be doing I got to see um, got to work with patients and I got to see surgeries and I got to just see I got to scrub in on them and I just got to do all these cool things that are just like wow this is absolutely what I want to do and I think that this experience really opened my eyes to the need internationally and um, just the possible um, opportunity to do further mission trips like this um, after I you know after I get um, those tools and and things that I can really help people with and I just think that would be really awesome it's <laughs> it's just so inspiring like just to think of the care that they were in the doctors were just so awesome and and they worked so hard and um, I just I actually got to see a lot of deliveries and c-sections and I even got to like scrub in and assist on one which is just crazy but even that was just so inspiring because I'm literally helping life like come in come into the world and like and just to see that all the long hours late nights they put to put into um, you know those emergency c-sections and things and just but like how that much that it really is making a difference in just everyday life and um, just giving people Hope. That's what I love about healthcare. It's um, just renewing people's hope. That was my first surgery I scrubbed in on. It was C-section of twin girls, and I was literally I wasn't doing very much in that, but I was just kind of standing there, like, and I was next to the mom, and um, I just I got to see her face as like she saw her twins for the first time, and I started tearing up like while I was in like while I was in the room, and I was like, oh my gosh, like keep it together, you know. But I was just like. It was just such a cool moment um, for me to see that and just to, even just to think, this sounds really weird, but think about the people that were there when I was born, you know, and just like how grateful I am that, you know, just that they were there and that, that all went safe and 
I don't know. It was just, it was a cool moment and um, I, I loved it. <laughs> I, this has been a life-changing summer for me. I can already tell um, just how I've come back and I'm just, even coming back, like some people are like, is it hard coming back? And, you know, I'm just like full of joy. Like I, I genuinely like just feel filled up. And I, and I think that part of that is just, I realized, um, I was just so anxious, you know, being a student athlete, like you just, you have to take advantage of every free minute that you have to study and, um, you know, to do this or that. And I just really think I was kind of like freed from that. And, you know, of course, like I'm going to work hard and put my work in, but it just doesn't feel as stressful because there's just so much more to life than like, than just being stressed out about like things you have to get done, like just going over there and just getting to build relationships with people and it just kind of puts things in a new perspective and I genuinely feel changed from the whole experience.